Black scientist Kenneth Olden, PhD, is a trailblazing cell biologist and toxicologist. Olden was the first to demonstrate that by blocking the interaction between fibronectin and the integrin receptor, organ-specific cancer spread could be prevented, significantly impacting cancer research. His research laid the groundwork for further studies on how the extracellular matrix influences the behavior of cancer cells. Olden's work has also helped clarify the role of glycosylation in cancer development. Olden was born in 1938 in Parrotsville, Tennessee. He grew up in a time and place where opportunities for African Americans were severely limited by both poverty and racial segregation. Undeterred, he went to Knoxville College, where he graduated in 1960 with a Bachelor of Science degree in biology. In 1964, he earned a Master of Science degree in genetics from the University of Michigan. Finally, he got a PhD in cell biology and biochemistry from Temple University in 1970. Next, Olden worked as a postdoctoral fellow and instructor at Harvard University Medical School from 1970 to 1974. There, he worked on characterizing a cell wall mutant of E. coli, contributing to our understanding of cellular processes. He next moved to the National Cancer Institute, NCI, at the National Institutes of Health, NIH, to become the first black person to be awarded tenure and promoted to the rank of independent investigator in 1977. From 1979 to 1991, Olden worked at Howard University as director of the Howard University Cancer Center, professor and chairman of the Department of Oncology. Here, he focused on cancers prevalent among people of color, aligning his research with social needs. In 1991, Olden was appointed director of the National Institute of Environmental Health Sciences, NIEHS, and the National Toxicology Program, becoming the first black person to head an NIH institute. 